The engines in sports cars are vital, but sometimes they're not made by the same company you might think. Many sports cars, supercars, and even concept cars actually use engines from other brands. So here are the 12 cool cars that share engines with different brands, something you might not have known. So let's get started. 12. McLaren F1 And BMW, the McLaren F1 was a groundbreaking car known for its amazing performance and style. It became legendary in the world of motorsport, winning its first race at the 24 Hours Le Mans in 1995. What made it go so fast? Well, it was powered by a BMW S70-2 V12 engine. But before this powerful engine ended up in the McLaren F1, BMW tested it in a special BMW E34 M5 wagon. This wagon was one of a kind and wasn't widely seen by the public. However, it was just as powerful as the McLaren F1, showing off the potential of that amazing engine. 11. Volvo XC90 and Noble M600 The Volvo XC90 is a luxury SUV that's been around since 2002, and it's now in its second generation. When it first came out, it offered a range of engine options. In 2005, Volvo added the B8444 SV8 engine, which was actually built by Yamaha. This V8 was the first one Yamaha made for a production car. Volvo stuck with this engine until they made some changes to their management. Then, in 2010, Noble Automotive released their Noble M600 model, and guess what? It used the same 4.4-liter V8 engine from Yamaha that Volvo had been using. Somewhere between 2014 and 2016, Yamaha made a 5.0-liter version of the V8 engine for Volvo's Supercar series. 10. Ford Galaxy and BSC Mono Car enthusiasts in the US might be familiar with the Ford Galaxy, a full-size sedan from the 1950s and 60s. But in Europe, the name Galaxy was given to a minivan. The first generation of the Galaxy was actually a collaboration with VEW. However, the 2.3-liter Duratec four-cylinder engine from this minivan was repurposed. After some tweaks by the renowned Cosworth, it ended up powering the remarkable single-seater race car known as the Biak Mono. 9. Ford Mustang SN95 and Kvale Mangusta In the 1990s, Kvale took over de Tommaso's plans and models. They completed de Tommaso's sports car project, the Bigua, and marketed it as a Cavail. Interestingly, the Mangusta, as it was called, didn't just share an engine with the SN95 Mustang. While it had a unique exterior design that stood out from other cars of its time, much of its interior was borrowed directly from the Mustang. Despite some upgrades in trim and materials, many components like the switchgear and gauge cluster were identical to those found in the Mustang. Today, the Mangusta is largely forgotten, making it a rare find in automotive history. Surprisingly, if you do come across one, it can be relatively inexpensive. 8. Lamborghini Huracan and Audi R8 Both Audi and Lamborghini are under the Volkswagen umbrella, so it's not surprising that they share the same engine. The Huracan is a lightning-fast supercar known for its unique design, while the R8 is also highly regarded in the sports car world. Despite both vehicles being equipped with the same 5.2-liter, naturally aspirated V10 engine, they offer distinct driving experiences. The Huracan made history by winning Lamborghini's first race at the 2018 24 Hours of Daytona, while the Audi R8 has served as a safety car in prestigious events like the FIA World Endurance Championship and the 24 Hours of Le Mans. 7. Audi RS4 and Gumpert Apollo The B7 Audi RS4 is often seen as one of Audi's best-performing cars. It had a powerful 4.2-liter V8 engine, all-wheel drive, and a six-speed manual gearbox, making it a top-notch sedan for speed. However, it was a bit more mature compared to the wild BMW M3 and Mercedes C63 AMG. After coming back from China, where he managed VW Audi dealerships, Roland Gumpert created what he called a road car with the feel of a race car. It was called the Gumpert Apollo. Despite its unconventional looks, it used the same 4.2-liter V8 engine found in the Audi RS4, the original R8, and the Spyker C8. In the Apollo, this engine was fitted with two turbos, resulting in power outputs ranging from 650 to 800 GP. 6. Lotus Evora and Toyota Celica Similar to the Lotus Elise, the Evora is equipped with a Toyota engine. Lotus Cars established a partnership with Toyota in 1982, exchanging intellectual property. This collaboration led to Lotus assisting in the development of the Toyota Celica NT, and they have continued to utilize Toyota engines and components in their vehicles since then. The Evora is powered by a 3.5-liter supercharged Toyota 2GR FE V6 engine, which delivers more power compared to the Camry's engine. 
This same 3.5-liter Toyota 2 GR FE V6 engine is also used in Highlander SUVs and the Lexus ES350. 5. Renault Clio Phase 6 and Citroën C8 After the PRV V6 engine faced controversy and was discontinued, the PSA Group collaborated with rivals to develop the ES9, a 3.0-liter V6 unit. This new engine, known as the ES9, had a displacement of 3.0 liters. The ES9 engine wasn't just limited to powering mundane vehicles. It also found its way into the Renault Clio Sport V6, a high-performance car known for its exhilarating driving experience. On the other hand, it was also used in the Citroën C8 minivan, which didn't quite have a stellar reputation. In comparison, the Clio Sport V6 provided a much more fitting and exciting application for the ES9 powertrain. 4. Mini Hatch and Chrysler PT Cruiser The Tritec four-cylinder engine, a collaboration between Chrysler and BMW, was made by Tritec Motors in Brazil. Besides being in the first-generation Mini R50, it also powered another retro-styled hatchback. The Chrysler PT Cruiser across the ocean also used the Tritec four-cylinder engine, as did the Dodge Hornet hot hatchback concept from the 2000s. And when it came to the Mini Cooper S, the Tritec engine got a supercharger, boosting its performance. 3. Koenigsegg CC 8S and Ford Koenigsegg Automotive AB used a Ford modular 4.7-liter supercharged DOHC V8 engine in the CC 8S when it debuted in 2002. However, recognizing the engine's limitations, they improved it with new pistons, a redesigned crankcase gas recirculation system, and other modifications. Afterward, Koenigsegg started manufacturing their own engines, yet they retained the Ford modular engine as the base. The Ford E-Series, for example, utilizes a 4.6-liter engine with two valves. Other vehicles equipped with Ford's modular engine include the Ford Expedition, Lincoln Town Car, and the Ford Mustang. 2. 2013 Spyker B6 Venator and Toyota Unlike other cars mentioned, the B6 Venator is a concept car. Unveiled at the 2013 Geneva Motor Show, Spyker intended to launch the production model in 2014. However, due to declining sales and impending bankruptcy, their plans were thwarted. Initially, Spyker didn't specify their engine supplier, but they had previously used Audi engines. Later, Spyker announced a partnership with Lotus for their engines, and since most Lotus engines are sourced from Toyota, the B6 Venator utilized a Toyota ZZ series engine. This engine can also be found in vehicles like the Corolla XRS, Lotus Elise, and Chevrolet Prism. 1. Donkervort D8 GTO and Audi RS3 the Donkervort D8 GTO is a handmade track car known for its absence of electronic aids and lightweight carbon fiber construction, typical of its class. Previously, Donkervort Automobilin utilized Ford engines in their vehicles. However, since 1996, they have transitioned to using Audi engines. The Donkervort D8 GTO is powered by a 2.5-liter TFSI engine, which it shares with the Audi RS3. This same engine can also be found in other Audi models, like the TTRS and RSQ3. So guys, that wraps up today's video. Did any of these surprises you? Which one was your favorite? Let us know your thoughts in the comments below. If you enjoyed, give us a thumbs up and subscribe for more content. Until next time, drive safe.